We are back for part two of today's scanner extravaganza. <laughs> I got my two buddies tweeting away here. In case you missed the Pooey cooking show, uh, <laughs> he's, got, he's got his own cooking right, show. Look, he's... <laughs> Slight temperature problem uh, on the fryer, but we got it all resolved. Took a little bit longer. Look at that. Uh, but there. That, that was pretty good to me, Pooey. That is what you want. That's some medium rare prime rib, deep fried. Yeah, he deep, he's a fried boy. Yeah, it got turned down closer to 300 when I should be at 325. Foodie so cooking I show, everybody. Don't bread. miss it. All right, there's more. So you get your good medium rare pieces right here. See, he's describing the meat size. for us here. And you get your more medium, which pink and brown. I like the red one. I like my beef medium rare red like this. You don't want to overcook your beef because it takes the flavor out. And if you're going to eat dead cow, you want to have nice, fresh dead cow. This was funny. Future Notch, I met Jen and uh, GM. Try Mess Riders shall suffer more as Kelsey handpicks his replacement. I don't know if Kelsey will handpick. I, I don't know what they're going to do this time. They they could throw us off a little bit on this one. See here, look. This is the C Tran guy. Look at the amazing, another amazing holiday and love being out. See, he goes out there, man. How come you don't go out there, you fucking hack, Kelsey? The TriMet people are more, you know, it's they're so secluded from reality. They don't. Tom, our buddy Tom. <laughs> Tom Taker, he's funny. Check out his tweets. What happened here, Pootie? That page doesn't exist, Pootie. What is this? Do we get... They've been begging... What is this shit? <laughs> what the fuck is that shit? All right. Um... He gets them. He had uh, assault with a bat. This is a Mac. He got a bunch of Max calls here. The train, train 68. 68? 68. Somebody was just uh, assaulting this person. I'm northbound at uh, Rosa Parks. A guy has a baseball bat and he's assaulted several people. Let me answer him here. Okay. I'll copy, and uh, he's on your train or on the platform? The platform right now. Okay, I copy. Uh, can I get a description of the person? Uh, yes, African-American, um, male, uh, blue jeans, black jacket, red backpack, bald, maybe 5'9", um, 150. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, wait a minute. This was first. Oh no, okay, we got it. I'm not sure. Okay, I copy. And uh, are you aware, was he on your train at all when, uh, did he come off your train or was he on the platform when you got there? I believe he was on my train. Okay, I copy, I like that. Apparently this is the uh, guy right here that went bananas and started hitting people over there with a baseball bat. How fun for you. The uh, person still on the platform there? Uh, no, he walked off and he crossed the street. Um, which way would that be? To the west. He crossed into the crosswalk and towards the, uh, I think that's where the park's behind us. Hmm. Okay, here's part two. 9526. 9526. Yeah, no suspect, no victims here on the scene. We're going to need to take the train out of service, at least this car. Where's the pr transit police when you fucking need them? Nowhere to be found, as always. As fucking always. You might as well defund the police because they ain't around when you need them. Yeah, sir, I was talking with some of the police officers. Um, Did you want me to go back to the cab? Uh, 60 uh, affirmative. 
Uh, we're going to be a supervisors offloading your train now, so we'll get you rolling here shortly. I got Everybody fuck it out, man. Claudia, yeah. was it just your uh, lead car that was uh, damaged? Yes. And what was the car number of that? The 68, that's a survey of lead car 243. Um, I didn't see any damage to the trailing car. Can I copy? Thank you. Uh, midnight 13. Yes, Pootie, I'm doing a video since that's what you want. I five two six. Yeah, one victim was found. Uh, they'll be transported AMR three four two to Emmanuel, and police are probably going to request a video of that train. So this guy actually hurt somebody bad enough to go to the hospital. Random attacks. That's very pretty rare, but I think it's going to be more and more common as as life goes on in the United States of America. Sixty eight. 68 on northbound uh, at uh, Delft Park. I've got an emergency uh, call about a passenger that needs medical. I'm going to go check it out. I cop. Check it out. Train 5, trash fire. Fulton Mall, westbound, one of the cross cannon was on fire. <laughs> oh, is that the same one that the bus is called in? I bet you it was. Okay, I copy one of the mall trash cannon. These are Christmas days. Uh, These are Christmas calls, too. What is the nearest intersection for that? It's uh, by the station fourth and uh, mall. Train 69, he tried to stop my train with his body. He's really making good descriptions. Train 69, I've got a man here at Kenton, Denver, who aggressively tried to stop my train with his body. Okay. Okay, I copy. And uh, you didn't make any contact. You see how hard it is to do max calls because they're they're very short files. So this is good work here, Woody. Uh, you know, no contact made um, not on the platform at the time of the party. My was called. My door closed. My train was moving, which decided to run out in front of me and attack me. Uh, he's cleared. I'm rolling. <laughs> hmm. Train 7, someone's screaming. Train 7. Train 7. Yeah, I got someone now uh, under the uh, lead car screaming. Oh. Okay, I copy. <laughs> uh, 9515. Five. Why not? Why not? Um, they look like uh, they're fighting. Oh, fun. even more fun. Right, try that, folks. See the world. Train 84, trash can. 84. Sounds like I'm not coming through. Um, if you copy this, there's a trash can in the southbound right away at Park Road. Is permission to uh, hop out and grab it? Permission granted. Check it out. Copy clear to uh, grab the trash can. Thank you. Grab the can. Check trash can, man. Five, two, nine. 959 Gateway. Yeah, can I get down to Park Road? We've got somebody wandering around the platform there. It seems to be the cause of our uh, trash can on the right of way among uh, a variety of other things. I copy all of the Park Road. He just possessed. Garbage at Kenton, Denver. Train 61. 61, northbound Kenton, Denver. About a couple hundred feet um, ahead of me, in front of me, there's a garbage can, and it looks like some garbage bags um, that are touching the running rail. Ooh. Bill Moore. All right, trash can man setting fires. 9529. 9529, 205. Uh, I just want to give you a heads up. The uh, subject on the platform keeps setting small things on fire. I've uh, dispatched police that way uh, preemptively. Hi, Gabby. Thank you. 059. Yeah, I'll pull up right now. All right, sounds good. He's walking uh, west in the west. West in the east. <laughs> west in the west, excuse me. <laughs> I copy. Uh, let me know if they clear when they get to uh, Cleveland. Trans 9, not receiving. 9529, I told him to leave property. I need permission to get into the right of way. There's a fire in the ballast, and then there's one at the... What is that? The side of the platform as well, but I want to stomp out the one in the ballast. 
Uh, you'll be clear for that. I don't currently have any trains in the area. And do you think we need the uh, fire department response? Uh, I'm not from what I can see, but I'll let you know if that changes. Thank you. 104. 529. Uh, 529, it looks like the fire is out. That was uh, excellent creative use of the tools at your disposal. I copy. I'm going to make sure you left the parking ride, so I'm going to head back up. I copy, thanks. Uh, 106. 9529. 9529. 9529. Uh, 9, 9. uh, Police spoke with a gentleman. They told him, don't ever come back on time at property, ever. And they're clear. I'm going to be clear. And the person's off property. I got me all that. Thanks. Yeah, I told him never come back. <laughs> I'm sure he's going to listen to that. 2023, person playing chicken. Train 23. Train 23. Uh, 23 in the platform in Cleveland. Just change cabs. Getting ready to head to West Bend of the Yard. And uh, I've got uh, <coughs> a stressed person sitting on the crossover right in front of me, daring me to come uh, grab him. Uh, just left the supervisor help me clear the car. I'm calling this for this for information. All right, bye, two, three. Okay, I copy. It just gets better and better out here, doesn't it? I'm it right now. All right, sounds good. He's walking uh, west in the west. <laughs> west in the east. Question the west, excuse me. Did I just hear that? I copy. Uh, let me know if they clear when they get to. 9523. 9523. He crossed Cleveland and continued west, uh, so heads up for the next eastbound. I don't know where he's at. Yeah, it looks like about 162 so far. Can I have head over, guys? And one more. 9523. 9523, looks like, uh, with the track by a police route. Yeah, for him. Police are, uh, with him now. We can roll 23 with caution through, uh, the intersection here. Sounds good, thanks. Train 23, clear the proper. Extra caution at Kelly Crossing, please. All right, seizure on train 6. Calling train 6, going to hold there. Train 84, cancel your stick going to hold there. 6 flying gateway, signal cancel. 8524. 5529. Thank you. Hey, how are you? I'm sorry. 5529. Can you do a walk through train 6 one looking for somebody who uh, is suffering or has suffered a seizure? They called 911. We're trying to identify which train they're on board. 95299. Copy. I'll go look. Thank you. Train 4, while you're doing your uh, swapping cabs, will you please do a walk through and see if you can find this person on board your train? It's mass mayhem everywhere. So we're number three. Four, I have a clear contest. Okay, four, I got the clear contest. Thanks. At uh, 147. Four. 959. 959. 959. 61 clear as well. Nobody having any medical issues on history. All right, so nobody on board 61 uh, uh, looks like they recently suffered a seizure or needs any kind of medical assistance. 9529, affirmative. I talked to everybody and they said they're all okay. All right, I copy that. Thanks. 6-1, you'll be clear. And 8-4, you'll be clear. I can't find him. More medical. 2-3. Yeah, go ahead. We're at the Ruby Junction. I uh, got train 6-1. It's going to be arriving there in a couple minutes. And uh, sounds like uh, uh, medical is going to be arriving for a passenger on board. Uh, we're not sure what's going on with the person. Jesus, what a mess. Police and medical coming up. Police now? 9523. 9523. Cleveland, we need medical or police or both. Don't know. Police, medical, or police, or both? African American, uh, male, 20 ish, white sheet, black pants. White sheet, black pants. So white shoes or white sheet? <laughs> it's a white sheet. It's requesting medical attention. A white sheet. Oh my god. Yes, he's up walking around. He's just cold, he says. Yep. Yes, he's up walking around. He's dispossessed. Says, dispossessed in the land of the free. And he just said he's cold, or did he say, is there a reason that he needs medical? He says he's got the COVID and he feels ill. He's got the COVID, the COVID, he said the magic word. And he just said he's cold, or did he 
He said he had an upset stomach <laughs> and he's cold. Uh, no help for you. Nine five two three. Nine five two three. AMR declined uh, transport. Well, I'll be clear. Yeah. I copy they declined transport. I feel clear. Into the ditch. All right. Honey bucket or a regular bucket? Train six Train six zero. Yeah, six zero when you finish out. <clears throat> then decide to go to Pitway in the intersection with, I believe it's 92nd or 98. It's a honey bucket fellow in the street. It's very close to the right of way, but um, uh, I believe it needs to, uh, to remove. You need to move. Moving the poop shack. Yeah, 9525. There we go. Yeah, 9525. Honey buckets here. Surprisingly the auto lane. Um, inbound, but it's not a... It's near but clear of our track. I'll see what I can do about you pushing it out of the way. All right, got that. Thanks. That's 410. Get the bucket out of there. Okay, dispatchers in dark clothing. Oh my God, train 61. Train 61. 61. Um, doing 55 on the van field, and I came across some um, trespassers. They are right here by Lloyd Center. They have on dark clothing. They are walking um, west in the east, and it scares the shit out of me. I'm sorry. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah, sounds like it. You said they're walking west in the east? Yeah, we're, 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 we're. Oh, she's scared. Did you hear that? She started breaking up. Oh, uh, just a little uh, high horn. High horn. Whoop. All right, I copy that. And uh, do you know uh, where in relation to, uh, like, your pass or 13th they, they were? Um, I caught them, like, right when the, right when the, um, the, the, the bar, the, the bar thing comes, like, when we're getting right there, we're going eastbound, and you hit 84, and the rail ends the right, like, literally right at the, at the rail. They have on dark clothes, and they're walking um, in the dark area. You, I, I barely even seen them, like, barely seen them. If he wouldn't have turned around and I seen his white face, I wouldn't have seen them. So, like, the bar on the ramp there? Uh, yeah, they're still walking west in the east. Um, I'm in the platform, but they're still walking west in the east. All right, I copy. Uh, we'll see if we can get somebody up that way. Here comes a high horn. Okay, two sleepers. Train 40. Train 40. Yeah, I got a two sleeper in the front car and they are not moving. Yep. And not even respond. Okay, sleepers in the sleep. Not responding. Okay, next up, guy in the row. 61. Uh, is 9532 on a rose quarter? Uh, firm, he should be there. Uh, do you need something? That's where they go over here, right? 9532, just FYI, our guy in the right of way is back down here by a uh, grain goes. house. Into the ditch he goes to die. Die like a dog in America. That's how you do it, man. Must be our gentleman from last Saturday. Affirmative, he's back on his same old. 9532 to control. I'll go over there and take a look. Um, is he interfering with train traffic right now? Oh, well, he's back next to in the middle. Um, I gave him bail. He did move, but yeah. it was just kind of like, you know, in and out how he was last time. Yeah. Okay. I'm fine, too. 932. So I had another conversation with him. Asked him to stay out of the trackway. I'm sure he's going to listen to you. He says he will do that. Uh, if not, the next train through, let us know. Uh, we'll probably have to call police if he doesn't. Yeah, I'll be. Thanks for chatting with 525. Yep. 
Knock it off. North Bound just departed Killingsworth. I have an individual causing issues on the train with other passengers. I told him if he uh, doesn't knock it off, he's going to have to get off the train, but I still hear him talking back there. Um, I'll let you know when I pull into Rosa Parks and what's going on. Okay, let me know when we, if uh, we need to send anybody or anything. 64, copy. Thanks. 0603. Train 62. Train 62. If I don't get... Oh, it looks like it's working now. Um, I was going to ask. That's something else. All right. Uh, fire. Another fire. Yeah, it's 2220. Somebody lit a fire over here. Okay, we're exactly out there. Did they light a fire? It's on the uh, southbound platform just off of it on the north end. Okay, and what kind of, what, like how big of a fire are we talking about here? Something we can put out with some water? Do I need to call the fire department? Yeah, it's a small fire. I'll have to go look at it. Uh, basically, somebody had a trash can full of stuff. And the, uh, I heard a loud bang, and the security guard from the uh, hotel over here says it blew up. And then somebody sat there and lit, lit a fire on the other side. All the homeless are trying to stay warm. This is part two, Jody. Okay, so it's not completely, so it's not on our property. Is it on the hotel property? Uh, it's not on the hotel property. It's kind of like on the Holiday Inn property or our property. It's right by the, uh, uh, whatever that blue building. Yeah, who cares? All right, try Mad Hero. I'll, oh, kill them all, in other words. Kill them all. 2220, Mount Hood. 2220. Yeah, it's 2220. I uh, stamped out the fire. It's 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 gone. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe a little bit of smoldering, but I'll keep an eye on it. Okay, I copy. Appears to be contained at this time. Yeah, let me know if. Uh, yeah, he stamped it out. Try my hero. He didn't knock it off. <laughs> Before. Train 64. Yeah, this individual, individual is still causing problems on the train and yeah. bugging passengers. Uh, oh, I'm at Denver northbound. I asked him to leave the train. He won't do it. Nope. 64. He was uh, harassing passengers, trying to light stuff on fire, and he was banging on my door. Oh, nice so. guy. Four. Train 64. 64. He's in my lead car. White male, wearing all black pants and down jacket with uh, white sneakers on. Okay, supervisor is in route. Yeah. 64 coming. 64 on the one, he just got off. He's gone. Train 64, thanks. Zero and, and individual on the platform, thanks. I see him. 0616. And that 5, 3, 2, that's it. Damn shame they don't have the guardian angels out there riding in those max trains to help with shit like that, but nope. They're going to have the, you know what, they're going to have the, here it comes, where is my crisis team video, come on, where's my crisis team, here it is, they're going to have this. <laughs> Um, that must be the cat trying to get in here. <laughs> uh, attention operators, you are not required to wear a face covering while in the cab with a closed door wow. and window. If you have any questions or concerns, contact your manager. 629. Wow, look at that. That's the cat. He's trying to get in here. Hold on, hold on. I got to get but the cat. Uh, that wasn't a cat. That's somebody pounding. All right. So the max operators don't have to wear that, huh? What are the coffee? Train 42. Go ahead. 
Yeah, right behind the uh, my leak house uh, door. Yep. Is it flooded with coffee? Uh, if there's any cleaner, yeah, they can clean it. Not on Christmas. Coffee, you said? Yeah, coffee. Yeah, it's all over on the floor at uh, a powder. Okay. Uh, do you have some paper towels you can at least put down and uh, put on the slide? Um. Yeah, I can try that. And uh, yeah, why don't you try that? Yeah, meanwhile, and uh, I just had a passenger right here. Uh, it's like naked, and uh, if there's any supervisor, I would uh, have him you know, take care of him. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> meanwhile. <laughs> Meanwhile, there's. <laughs> All right, listen, listen again, listen. So we got coffee, and then right at the end. Um. Yeah, I can try that. And uh. Yeah, meanwhile, and uh, I just had a passenger right here. Uh, it's like naked, and uh, if there's any supervisor, I would. Uh, <laughs> I like the way. He, I like the way. He, he was robbed of his pants. Let's see. What is this? Let's see. Do we need police or anything? Is this is this on? Well, the individual is that white man has no pants on, so he was robbed. I told him he had to the train. He isn't moving yet, but I'll go back there. Well, you don't need to. You don't need clothes to ride TriMet. Remember? Fuck, man. So the individual is still on the train? I believe so. I'm trying to deal with this you enormous know, coffee spill as well. I, you know, I, they told, they say you don't need pants. I mean, I've heard them say it themselves. Like, apparently, Max is different. Uh, white male, probably 40. Okay, I'll be on the phone with police. Maybe he was robbed of his pants. Actually, I mean, he is it... off the train. I think he's over by the buses right now. Okay, off the train. I copy. Maybe he was. Maybe he. I mean, what? You gonna just leave him there? He was robbed. Three. Uh, white male, probably forty. Okay, I'll be on the phone with police. All right, we just heard it. Okay, last call. No. Go ahead. Uh, he fashioned his jacket into some sort of a skirt and got on train 21. So, so I guess we'll be clear, please. All righty, then I'll call him back. Thank you. Thank you. 713. You can ride. Yep, that's bad management. Nashville, part two. Six six nine. Six six nine. Did you get a report of a uh, backpack, lone backpack, sitting on a bench down here at Rose Court? <laughs> I did not. Okay, well, I was told uh, it just contains a uh, blanket and some other stuff. I'm going to um, stick it inside the trolley barn and pass it off to somebody later. I got me. Yeah. No bomb because there hasn't been any bombs. Okay. Fire in the back car because naked friends. What, what happened? Oh, the guy. What do you want? Eastbound, 148th Avenue. Show me out the step. Step out. They say there's a fire in the back car. Oh, is this the same guy? So he's crazy as a coot. Okay, I copy. Um, let me know what's going on as soon as you find out so I can determine what to do with the fire <laughs> department, etc. 9525. Can I have you start heading that way, please? 148 eastbound. Yeah, 9525, I copy. It's just as crazy over there in the max as it is in the bus. Train 21. 21. I got a gentleman on the train. He says he lit the fire because uh, his friend can't. Oh, 
uh, purple. Yeah, and yeah, but the fire is out now. Uh, but there was a fire. There's a sound now. Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, I don't see any damage. No, no fire damage. All right. Oh my God. Train 21, he's still on board the train. 21 affirmative, uh, white gentleman with glasses, all gray sweatsuit. Ugh, painful. Did he say he set this fire? He said he set the fire because his friend's hands were, uh, cold. And he, he said he had frostbite. But I think it's a gentleman who actually has no draws on, who jumped aboard, who got on a train back at, uh, BTC. Uh. God, unbelievable. Smoking on the train now. 61. Train 61. K9532, do a walkthrough at RRQ. I'm coming across the rear. Somebody is smoking a cigarette and marijuana on the train. I can smell it coming through the back. 9532. I think it means 61. Uh, RRQ is marked down. Okay, I'm at the fifth and Gleason. I'll have to get back over there. Alright. I don't smell it anymore after I made an announcement that I can smell it. Yeah, Max is a big, as big of a shit show as a bus. Sunshare cushion. Train 44. Train 44. 44, good morning. Uh, I'm almost to Old Town. Uh, can we have a supervisor check on a gentleman behind me? Apparently, he, he brought on one of those uh, cushions for a sun chair, and he's not letting people sit around him. Is that lead car, driving car? <laughs> right behind me in the lead car. Warming fire update. I'm filming at Cleveland. I met up with uh, the one passenger on the train. He stated that he didn't like any fires. Uh, the pantless guy. Pantless guy. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll uh, keep tap on the rest of the day. Everybody's pretty much aware of what he's been up to this morning on the west side and out here. So, <laughs> thanks for your help. <laughs> Is it part two to this? At first, I was talking to him. He said he's going to be in soft and doesn't want any problems. Mm -hmm. So he's trying to get downtown. So hopefully he gets where he needs to go. Yeah. All right. Thank you. A36. What is this? Bambi. Oh, no. He's a little Bambi. In between uh, Willow Creek and Quitama. So, well, you know, uh, Bambi's dad's running around out here. Um, it's just uh, information for the westbounds. Okay, Bambi. it's information for all trains. Be on the lookout for Bambi's dad out there between Quitama and Willow Creek. Use caution. What, Bambi. What's that supposed to be? <laughs> you mean that a deer, right? Police blocking. Time for two. I'm arriving. We now have three police vehicles in our right of way. I'm trying All to right. figure out what's going on associated with the hotel. Okay, another we're blocking up at uh, between uh, getting into OCC westbound. Is that correct? Affirmative. Yeah, they are uh, just east of Grand, right there at the corner of Grand and Holiday. All right, part two. Yeah, uh, 9532, they're investigating a homicide here at 515 oh, Southwest Holiday or Northeast Holiday at the Flowers. How about a homicide? Louise Flowers Tower here. So walking speed for eastbound, but westbound will not be getting through here for quite a while. Oh, that was okay. So, and so that is the bus bridge. Also, like I said, are they blocking the panel K also? So like where our bus is or anything else? Our streetcar? Affirmative. Affirmative. They're across the uh, northbound track for the... Alright, part three. Affirmative. We're going to need to do turn back. Turn back. Copy that. I figure we have at least an hour before an hour. they've got this contained to where they can even consider moving vehicles out of our right of way. Well, okay. 
Oh, we're going to start your backs. I'm going to look at... I didn't see any... Turning no. back at OCC westbound on those well, That didn't turn out to be an hour because there was no long bus bridges. Trash can fire. Uh, five, two, five. Yeah, that individual out there, Cleveland, he's on train five now. They got the lit up, garbage can lit on fire right out on the platform. Nobody's uh, saying that they're the ones doing it. But anyway, it's off. Is this something we need police for right away? Um, I got to take care of one thing before that if, uh, if it's not urgent. No, well, it's not exactly at this time, but you know, just gonna try. It's just gonna continue. But anyway, we'll, uh, we'll get the train rolling. There's nothing you can do about all these people. Bus bridge. The train's going to make really good announcements. Uh, you're gonna we're gonna be set. Have a bus bridge being set up to come in and assist. Uh, pick up your passengers. Train you I did the announcement. People left the train. I uh, just wanna exit the train to customer service. See if there's anybody on board uh, or sleeping or anything. I don't know if you could uh, exit and do uh, customer service. 20 copy, I'll be out with my portable, thank you. Shitload of fucking calls here, booty. Making the round. Yeah, just show me how to check on that guy that was causing trouble and somebody went earlier, he's on my train and someone is just saying he's lighting a fire or something like that, so just show me how to check on that. Yeah, check on that. I copy with the portal the appropriate channel. And I have four. Okay, next up, smoke in the rear car, boy. Wait, wait. 382 in my... Wait a minute, is this... Okay. Okay, smoke in the rear car. 382 in my eastbound cab. There you go. I stand by. Not, uh, train 5. Another Can five. I get a description of this guy? This guy's... Okay. Now, they will put it down for us. There's a smoke everywhere in the back car. <laughs> There's also a like, smoke in the door. I believe this back car needs to be out of service. Oh. The guy's in my front car. He's wearing a a gray sweet shirt. He's a two blood, a white guy. He'll be sitting on the uh, six that goes to the cab. Mayhem out there, man. Part two. Number five. Is he still not wearing pants? Oh, is it? Affirmative. Oh, and he's declining that he had a fire in the back car. And he's actually in the front car right now. <laughs> That's the guy without pants. Well, that goes to show you, you don't have... <laughs> Two police are on the way to 60th. I'm going to hold that train there until they arrive. He's insane. 9-5, you two on the freeway, and I copy. Train 5, go ahead, offload your train, secure the cars. If you can, get this guy off the train. Police are in route. What am I doing with that? 9525, um, just to get back to you. So 21 Alpha, 27 Bravo, our set diversion, correct? Yeah, 25, that's pretty All right, I'll send 82 if you're ready then. Yeah, 25, I'm ready. Train 82, go ahead. Um, you'll be clear to proceed through the 21 Alpha, 21 Bravo switches. Okay, found them. They found them. Let's see what I found. 9522. 9522. And 9522, he's going back to the platform. He has a, a bike lock with him. There's a potential happen. I'll let you know if he gets on fire. All right, copy. Any side of the police? Three. He did 9525. 9525. All right, so I got some pictures on teams there. It's a... Uh, you know, damage, but he's got some got some scorch marks on the door, uh, car 309, Alpha, coupled end, and then there's a, uh, where he had lit the fire, whatever he was burning, it melted into the ground. <laughs> yeah, on the upper deck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, um, let's leave him offloaded, take him out of service. We'll just swap him at the yard. Uh, when he goes east, I'll send him into the yard at Ruby. Okay, can't even have a Christmas day. Any weapons? What? Any weapons seen or anything like that? No, I didn't see a bunch of bags. Just she Wait. just had a bomb wanted some help and now she's telling me I can't help her, so I don't know. This is a bus call. Nine nine zero six. Wait. Nine nine zero six.
Uh, Patrick there, we've been uh, given the A-OK to resume operation through the area. I don't think we need any speed restrictions. They've got yellow the tape up on the uh, right side of the train there. Uh, so we, we're good to go. Yeah, that was a quick question. Okay, no restrictions. And so we're good. And we're resuming service then. Thanks. Train 46, uh, you're going to be clearing your proper make an announcement. All right, we got that one. And here's the suspect. Price for all trains on the west side here. 911 is looking for a white male. He's about 6 foot, 185 pounds, with brown hair and blue eyes. He's wearing a black hat, a black puffy coat, and blue jeans. He's not walking very well, and he was last in the area of BCC or heading to BCC. Once again, this is a white male. Brown hair. Suspect! 9518. Morning, go ahead. Yeah, can we hold train uh, 25 for a moment? I think we have the individuals they're looking for walking on the platform, right? And trying to get in the front car. 25, hold there. Uh, Jesus. Escape by Max. And a 2 and a 1. 64. Train 64. 64, I just arrived at uh, Park. And somebody took a number two and one <laughs> right by my operator's door. It'll be my uh, departing cab when I leave. Oh, the shit, and they pissed right by his cab. 354, uh, is it too big to be contained by any of the photos or anything? It's taped off. I'll have to tape off the whole upper deck because it's there's urine all over the floor up there. Okay, well, let's have you, uh, you can grab the spill kit, let's uh, throw it down there, and we'll start checking off, see what we can come up with. How come buses don't have a spill kit? Won't get off, Nick. 22, 25. 22, 25. We have a person refusing to disembark the train here at Jackson, uh, trailing car at the couple in, 301 Bravo. Uh, two. Well, they refuse to take a blanket off of them, but uh, yeah, I can't even give you a blanket. A gender, approximately, is maybe 160 pounds. Uh, peach, pink, robe, um, draped in a black and white blanket with uh, a green raincoat. It looks like underneath. <clears throat> I think Caucasian. I, I can't give you a gender, unfortunately. I'm sorry. Um, now look. Oh, it's gone. The Georgia early voting. The scam go is going. All right, frequent flyer next. Halfway to IRQ southbound. Nine five two three is available. Can he um, talk to the guy behind me or get him off? The frequent flyer. He yelled at people's asses, telling people to get the F off. 9532, uh, 463. Yeah, yeah, it's great, isn't it? 9532. Okay, I'm on the platform of the road quarter dealing with an engine that's sleeping. Okay, we have someone on the train IRQ stop down that uh, is uh, being verbally bad with people on the train. Okay, I think you said a uh, train southbound at IRQ has a Volvo on the train. That's affirmative. If they can hold long enough for me to walk over there, I'll head there. And 63, uh, Sergeant O'Brien. Just total fucking mayhem. Thanks, 1055. 63, he fell asleep. And just play it by ear and have uh, 3 4 check it out if he wakes up and he has a problem again. And 63 was heavy wood for 3 2, because uh, 3 4 is already doing something, so. How many more I gotta do? Here? Okay. He's sitting right behind me. Thanks, set 1056. Ignoring us. 9534. Yeah, I'm here talking to the person. They're um, not responding to me. He's under a blanket, under a couple of blankets, just ignoring all of our commands. Understood. Uh, we do have police en route, so uh, hopefully we'll be arriving here shortly. Copy. Um, 
All right. Uh, acting like a monkey. 266. I have a lady and a guy that are high as heck on drugs or something, and she's just acting kind of crazy and off her rocker, and she's like acting like a monkey, <laughs> swinging around and stuff, and getting verbal. <laughs> Three more, please, drive, thanks. And train 66, I, are they being uh, destructive? Uh, what's going on exactly? <laughs> well, I wouldn't say destructive. I mean, nobody can get by them. They're like, you know, their legs are across the aisle. They're taking up four seats. Um, they're just kind of a nuisance at this point. Well, okay, uh, we'll meet the lead of the training car when we get it down to IR2. Tis the season. Train 86. And 86. 86. I'm halfway into the platform here. 82nd westbound. I gotta jump out and grab a trash can that's in the right away. Actually, maybe a passenger was gonna get it for me. So, never mind. Okay, I copy. Thanks. 12. Okay, Ben. <laughs> Here's a... <laughs> There's your pooey humor there. Bambi update, whatever Bambi's father is. 23. Did they kill him? 23. 23 West Round, just leaving Quatama. Just an update. Bambi's father is now on the uh, north side of the tracks up along the research center's fence line. Okay, that's information for all Blue Line trains. We still have uh, Bambi and the family out there. Quatama, Willow Creek area. Kill them all! Kill them, shoot them, kill them, kill them. Make, make venison out of them, just like pooties. Non TriMet related. Train 68. 68, this is non TriMet related. This is on 6th and Clay. There's a guy that's burning a trash can Again. right next to the DMV building. It's a white male, probably in his 40s, a heavier set with glasses and a face shield. Uh, and the garbage can is on fire. They're all trying to stay warm in the land of the free. 9906. 9906. Yeah, fire's on scene, and they've uh, put the garbage can out. <laughs> Impressive. In six three. Six and Davis. I'm sure, bus drivers had to have called it in unless he's got there. This gentleman's gotten there uh, very recently, but he's sitting at the six and Burnside bus stop. He's got. Probably between 50 and 75 hypodermic beats on the platform and in the uh, roadway. Yes, that was called in. We heard that on the uh, Real Rip City. Called in multiple times, as a matter of fact. Guy on a bike. All right. At 1252. 66. Just a part of uh, six in college. Um, there's a guy on a bike that keeps on coming in and out of my tracks. Train 66. He keeps on, uh, this guy on a bike keeps on going in and out of my tracks, like right in front of the train. Hopefully, now he's off, out of the tracks, but um, I'll keep you updated. <laughs> 366, thanks. And 9519, information for you on 6th Avenue. 19, well, that was 6th in college? That's my reason. 19, I'll take a run up there and see what's happening. Thanks. At 12.53. What happened? Let's get... What happened? Flavelle, as you say. Train flopping in the... 82 at uh, Flavelle, as you say. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at the piece right here. It's kind of like a piece of trim. Um, it's up on the top of the train. There's like a six-inch trim. It kind of goes along the whole edge of the train at the top. It's got a... Uh, dark spot between the two creases like something uh, maybe a small piece came off or something I don't know but that's where it's flopping and uh, I'm sure I could take it uh, keep it at 35 and get it to gateway all right well, as you say yelling help or saying oh 669 669 yeah info for train 42 uh, a gentleman just got on his back car uh, he's I thought he was yelling help, but I think he's just saying oh over and over.
Okay. Um, 42, <laughs> let us know if you get your report. And uh, we'll have a walk somebody do a walkthrough if it needs. Yeah, okay. Bus 8 needs security. It's night. There's a bus driver of bus 8 here at um, Multnomah and Wheeler. He's requesting security or police. He has somebody uh, he needs off his bus. Okay, we can definitely do that, but he also needs to contact dispatch. Yeah, what's he call? <laughs> yeah, why? Copy, I'll pass it on. Why is he telling If it's an you? imminent threat, please let me know and I will call 911. But otherwise, they need to call dispatch. 669, um, yeah, he said he called dispatch and he's just waiting for a response. Oh. Okay. And are you on scene? Do you know if this is something that uh, is like a life threatening to somebody? I don't believe so. He's the only passenger on the bus who's just refusing to get off and oh, oh. Um, the driver oh, oh, oh. isn't on the bus. Okay. Like, okay, so yeah, we'll just leave it at that. He can make contact with dispatch, and um, if it escalates, let me know. Copy. Just trying to help. Yeah, no problem. I appreciate it. Like I said, if it was a life or death, I would definitely uh, step in. But Yeah, it's not. It's nothing. Wiping his nose on the window. Train 7. <laughs> Train 7. Train 7 and westbound, just departed at 162nd. I got a passenger emergency. There's a guy on my car right now, which is 207 Alpha, sitting in priority seating, wearing all black, wiping his nose on the windows and the stanchions and everything. For uh, what reason? What's going on? Hey, uh, I got a discooperative uh, individual that is uh, making a huge mess and being disruptive to the um, people around here. Do you have a description of him? Um, looks like a 50-year-old black male wearing black uh, coat, hey, brown. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> looks like uh, camel pants. Okay, I'll be on the phone and try and get him to respond. Merry Christmas. Last scene, try again, please. 2228 at Main. 2228 at Main, go ahead. I have, I've got a biohazard in one of the shelters. Okay, I'll put it on the list. Thank you. 1434. Truck 1386. 1386. We're at the Main Street parking lot requesting permission to enter the right of way to check out car to clean in the park truck. Truck 1386. Uh, okay. All the details. 1060. Train 60, I just arrived at park as I was walking to the break room. Someone on my train told me that they need 911. Okay, what's going on with him? He said he needs an ambulance. I understand that part of it. What are their symptoms? What did they say is wrong with them? Did you get any of that information? Yes, they want to know what you, what you, uh, why. Train 60, he said he's dehydrated and cold and he needs an ambulance. He's an African-American male, Bitch. maybe 30. He's got a, a dark coat and dark pants. Bitch. Okay, stay with him and I'll be on the phone with my Bitch. So much fun on train 60. Just been requested, could you let me know when they arrive? Train 60, yes sir. I also have another gentleman on this uh, same car, 220, who uh, uh, doesn't have his uh, pants on and he is oh. asleep. And uh, the cleaner said there's reports of him uh, touching himself inappropriately right I now. So. Well, I'll be back on the phone when I want. <laughs> Uh oh. Part two. Sixty. Police are coming for the guy without pants. <laughs> Sixty, I copy. Police are en route for the man without pants. <laughs> and seventy, I'm ready for your release. <laughs> Train seventy. <laughs> Train sixty. Sixty, the ambulance has arrived for the first gentleman. Would you like a description of the gentleman that the police are coming for? 
Um, I mean, I've already called him. If he's still on the train when they get there, um, if you want to point him out, it shouldn't. I, I'm not sure it should be too hard to find it. The only guy with no pants. <laughs> yeah, I copy. I would agree with you. <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ. Train 60. Train 60. Crazy. He no pants guy. Was he the guy with the orange and black hoodie? Yes, sir. He's starting to leave, and uh, he had his pants down just until now. He asked the cleaner if she wanted to watch him do things. This man, he needs to be something, talk to or something. Yeah, yeah, the police just arrived. If you want to let them know where he is and have them make contact with the cleaner so that they can get her description and book them and release them. At least he has to go through the booking process. Hit a trash can. And what kind of contact did we make? Uh, 42. Uh, it was on the left running rail between the platform and the running rail. Uh, it's just under the front bumper. Okay. Make good announcements for your passengers, please, and uh, we'll get some help to you as soon as we can. There you go. Part two is... 9527. 9527, can you start for 82nd Avenue, please? 9527, on my way to 82nd. Thanks. Train 42, let's have you hop out and see if you can, uh, see if you can determine if you can pull that garbage can out or if we've got it uh, wedged. 42, I can't be stepping out with my portable to see if I can do anything. Yeah, and use the crew door, please. Use the crew door. Can you get it out? 42. 42. 42, yeah. It's wedged in there about two feet from the front of the train. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to get it out without moving the train back. All right. Um, I go ahead and... Um, Hop back in, see if we can get people off the car through the crew door, and uh, we'll see what happens when the supervisor gets there. 42, I copy. I'll use the crew door and offload the front car. Fifteen twenty-six. It appears Christmas in South Boston is over. <laughs> Tree right out the door. <laughs> I wonder if we went to get it later or just stayed stay there. Okay, four. And 42, the front car is offloaded. Okay. Let's have you go ahead and access the trailing car, walk through, and it looks like you might have one door of the second car on the platform, but blocked by the bollard. Okay, five. Looks like that may be the case, yeah. Okay. Go ahead and make contact with folks back there, and if we can safely get them off the train, uh, you can coordinate that. And uh, hopefully by that time we'll have some additional help there to figure out what our, what our next, next. Uh, plan of attack is. All right, next. One, two, three, four. Nine, five, two, seven. 9527, I don't see any reason why we can't pull the train back at this point. Uh, if you want to go ahead and do that, I'll let you know if I see anything unusual happen. All right, train 42, you'll be clear to move walking speed going west in the eastbound track. Move that trash can. I have nothing. I have nothing at all. I, I mean... Nothing unusual. Okay. And uh, if you open the panel over the LOP, and I believe it's the second row for a break in and trip. <laughs> okay. Bio. Train 22. So many calls. Train 22. 22 Hatfield uh, in... 524, I have a bio up by the operator's cap, and I can spread up the spill kit and tape off the upper oh, section if you like. Okay, I copy. Yeah, let's have you do that. 22 copy. Yeah, it just uh, looks like you're in here. How come they don't have spill kits on buses? Music. Yeah. Train 5. Train 5. 
Train five coming up to Skidmore. I got a lot verbal and I told him to load down his music. Uh, but he said, no, there's no rule for it. So do you have a supervisor at uh, Rose Square? Yep, 9528. 9528, RQ. Train five eastbound at Skidmore. Can you meet him at Rose Square? Got a guy blaring his stereo. I take it it's on the lead car. Five, can you confirm lead car? Of course you can confirm it. How do you know? Right now. He's off the track. Okay, 2-8, he's off the track. Alright, another problem solved. Dinner. Train 22. Train 22. 22, eastbound, uh, halfway between Quitama and Willow Creek. There's a large deer standing on the north side of the tracks. It was clear, but just barely. Copy train yeah. two, that's information for you. Watch that out deer is going to get hit tonight. Train two, I copy that. I'll keep an eye out for him. Thanks. All right. Bio needs an ambulance. 49, so apparently he is a biohazard individual. He's requesting an ambulance. We are over ambulance. an hour of calls. Um, mail, not, oh, gosh, he's trying to talk to me. I'm not sure what he's trying to say. Um. Hispanic individual, uh, blue hospital pants, black shoes, black coat, uh, plaid stocking, I'm not stocking, uh, scarf, white, gray. I don't care what he looks like. Uh, blue, part two. 49, negative. He said that he's been drinking a lot of alcohol, but I don't see any signs of that. Um, nope, so I guess maybe just police. Okay, I copy. Just get the popo. All right. PDX shuttle. Train 82, relief. 22, 20, go ahead. Yeah, everybody stand by. I'm on the phone with 911. Uh, copy that. Uh, we got him off the train, and now he's gotten on a shuttle bus. <laughs> so he's being nothing but a major bad actor who just jumped off the shuttle bus. So, anyway, thank you. Okay. Yeah, they're just using TriMet as their shelter, basically. Okay, 2020, uh, Port of Portland has been advised, and if the guy comes back, let us know, and we'll see what we can do to get him proper services. Uh, copy that. Uh, maybe you didn't understand what uh, my last my last was. Um, he is on a shuttle bus, refusing to get off a shuttle bus now. <laughs> Affirmative. We have no control over the shuttle buses, so I have told the Port of Portland. Uh, affirmative. So on the way over here? That's what I've said. They need a goddamn homeless bus just for the homeless to go on and ride around all day. Why don't they just get one, put a big sign on it, homeless bus, and it drives around all the routes for any homeless person that needs a shelter. I do not know. We have. I would have to call their dispatch to find out. They've been advised that he was on our train refusing to leave and is now on their shuttle bus refusing to leave. So I've done what I can do with it. Okay. All right. Walking down the tracks. Train 19. 19. Hey, I'm... Uh, one block west of Pioneer Square, I'm blocked by a person who won't get out of the tracks. Okay. 9519. 9519, I'm at Jackson, headed that way. Okay. 19. Let me know when they're rolling, or when they're clear, if they're clear, 49. Okay, part two. 9519, yeah, he's a pioneer here, just walking right down the tracks. Uh, we might want to roll police on this guy tonight. Okay. Roll, please. 44. Send he prepared the to stop short game. of Pioneer. We have a person walking in the, in the driveway. 44, uh, being on site. Uh, I need a permission to it. So be to, uh, Pioneer from his, uh, shade of the way. So for one piece clear, you'll be clear to stop. Sound warning for Seaman's base. Fresh green parallel walk into the platform. 44, I copy to the clear of the way, so he <laughs> yeah. wants his clear of the way. Thanks. And 9519, do you have a description? 
9519, we have a uh, Caucasian male, approximately 70, 75 years old. Uh, Going to say about 5'6", five, 5'7", five, 150 pounds. Um, reddish gray hair. What's he wearing? Black jacket and uh, khaki pants. Okay, I will give him a call and see what they'll do. All right. Yeah, he's done a good job with these uh, calls. I got to tell you, this the max is. Nine hard. five one nine. Yeah, he's a pioneer here, just walking right down the track. <laughs> uh, we might want to roll police on this guy tonight. Oh, okay. Oh, yes, I heard that. So number number three. Uh, nine. Uh, police are going to attempt to respond, uh, I and I gave him the description. So let me know what what we see. And then I copy, and now again, he's standing on the corner here at Yam Hill, so uh, he's found trains to be aware. Thanks. Train 2, that's info for you. Be aware of this uh, person who's trying to jump in and out of the right away. It's just mayhem, mayhem, and more mayhem. He has a head injury. Six. We got a guy here on platform. He's got a head injury. He's, it's been reported that he fell down multiple times on the train. Would you please stand medical? They fell on the train you know which train it was the last green line uh that's headed to the city center mm, the walking dead are everywhere okay and you have a description of him and uh the extent of his injuries, any other medical concerns that you may see? That's it as far as I know. Uh, he's wearing gray shoes, gray pants, black jacket. Uh, the Walking Dead, man, they're just dead. A third speech, difficulty standing, uh, anything like that? Not at the moment because he's able to hold on to the rail, but like I said, it was reported to me and he agreed. You ready to cut off at the end? He agreed what? He agreed that he wanted medical to come pick him up. Yeah, he's at, he's he's done. Just throw him in the goddamn gutter. That's train forty nine. We're getting to the end. Train forty nine. Almost. No, oh, the lady, she is unstable. Uh, I was watching her from Cascades all the way. She was just yelling and screaming, and uh, actually, she was asking one guy, you you know, come into his face and. Sometimes just get off the train and get in, and I'm afraid she's going to pull right now on me or something in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> so we need somebody to check that out. Is that on your lead car or your trailing car? On uh, my lead car, yeah. I was watching her probably. That gentleman is running away from her. She, he's behind my cab now. But she's on the... Uh, one uh, lead car, a couple of cabs around that area. And uh, I'm on the west uh, heading it to White Channel. Yep, it's just a fucking giant shit show, is what it is, folks. A giant shit show, and you can hear it all on the TriMet scanner. 290. Okay, is the subject still there? Uh, the suspect is walking towards the Fred Myers right now. The uh, victim is here on platform with us. Yes. Any weapons? Uh, not at this time. Uh, the victim claims that he was hit over the head with something and almost maced. Is... I wonder if that was the, uh, the world. All right. Attention operators. Attention operators. With changing weather, give yourself time to stop during the conditions. <laughs> oh, <geez>. It's 2015. <laughs> Jeez, what a waste of those are. Box. 65. 65. 65, I'm on the platform at R2 North, and somebody threw a box in the right of way on the track, so I'm blocking, but I'll keep 
take it out and move it. Every fucking thing blo stops Max. Okay, G4S. Train 20. Train 20. Train 20, uh, Cleveland. I uh, just have an individual who is refusing to get off the train. I have uh, two G4S um, uh, personnel here trying to get him off. Uh, it just may take a little bit here. Not G4S? That sounds like Jesus. And train 20, uh, you get a disregard individual off the train. Finally saw the error of his ways. Okay, 959. Yeah, 9509. I'm on the platform making contact. Okay. Hey. Yeah. He kicked the door with his, you know, his foot. Train 25. Train 25. I have one uh, guy uh, at Twitter Creek. Uh, he's found the door was closed and he, he kicked the door with his. You know, with his foot, and uh, I just uh, maybe it's so far right out there to talk to him. Mm -hmm. Looks like uh, being Cody and a uh, short, long short of, about his knee. Yeah. Passenger emergency. Train four. Train four. Four, I have a passenger emergency. Apparently somebody is threatening a passenger in Jeez. my rear car near door four. Can you believe this? It's just crazy. Is she going to hold at sunset or she's going to roll to a PTC? She's eastbound at sunset. Oh, that's kind of daydreaming. Okay, I'll head down there. Okay, and I'll get police suited that way as well. Where is that? And train four. Train for eastbound sunset. Yeah, go ahead and hold there for the supervisor, and I'll get police to Joy as well. Train for I copy. Apparently, the gentleman that's doing the threatening is intoxicated and drinking on the train as well. And it sounds like the gentleman that um, is the uh, victim is in a wheelchair and is uh, not able to understand English very well. Okay. Understood. What is your trailing car number? Just gets better and better and better and better and better. I can't even believe that it's so fucking crazy. Unless they're in the cab alone with the window open on the third Wednesday of the month, it doesn't end in why. Attention all operators. Employees are required to wear face coverings at all times while on duty per SOP temp 03. Take the announcement at 2252. Eviction moratorium does not affect the Met. Train three. Sir. Train three. Yeah, train three. I think we're gonna need some help down here at Cleveland. We've got a guy here who uh, I'm not sure if he's quite understanding. He needs to get off the train. All right, 9509. Can you head to Cleveland, please? Yeah, Vixen, that's true. It does not. Too much eggnog. 9509. 9509. Yeah, we're gonna need police for this one. He's so intoxicated that he that he's not okay to get up. Okay, can I get a description of him? Yeah, um, he looks race, maybe Asian, yellow, uh, brown hair, glasses, got his mask on, gray uh, sweatshirt, black sweatshirt underneath. Look. And yes, I'm not kidding. The collapse of civilization can be heard. You can see what's really going on. While they're distracting us with Trump and all of this other shit, Trump is going to do a fascist uh, takeover. Who cares? I'd actually wish he would. Okay? End the fucking illusion of democracy right now. I mean, all of this stuff is pre-planned to distract you, okay? All of it. They don't want you to see the collapse. Of it. We're seeing it right here in this scanner. This this is what's really going on. It's uh, it. goddamn chaos. Uh, also, 9509, I see train 3 is rolling. Uh, is the individual, obviously... There's the millions of people suffering, and nobody gives a shit about us off the train, but uh, do police have them at this time? Yeah, that's true. Um, we're still dealing with him on the platform. We're trying to get him to walk to the path to get up to a 20. Um, but at this point, police are still here, and we are dealing with him um, <sighs> just to I make mean, sure. Really, it's just, we're fucking doomed as a society. It's over. Don't you get it, man? Can't walk. 1040 westbound approaching Millington Way. I just got a passenger... Emergency intercom from my back car, a woman calling saying she can't walk and needs some medical oh assistance. My God. Okay. When you arrive at... Uh, it just doesn't end here.
Get your cookie. Get your cookie. <laughs> Who's that? Well, okay. All right, that's it. That's it. I'm done. Let's give him a nice applause. Let's give him a nice hand. Where's here it is. And Pooty calls are now complete. That was one hour and fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes less than Rippy. But it gives you a good and I'm sure he only got less than probably less than ten percent of the shit that's going on. It's much worse than what you hear. It's just in unbelievably this was Christmas Day. You'd think that Christmas Day would have been quiet.